accountability. Amen. Right. And most important, R3, what we are demanding is the truth. Amen. Right. That is the only way we can build trust with law enforcement. They need to be transparent. We're here to declare, Attorney Hadley, that their silence is deafening. And more importantly, Attorney O'Neill, their silence is betrayal to the community. The community who entrust them to be leaders, not only for a certain community, but all of the community. You know, it is called equal justice. Equal justice. Equal protection of the law. And the fact that they have not uttered one word to this family. Not one word to Miss Douglas. Not one word to his sister Dorian. Not one word to his son Jane Tavius. Not one word to his little girls. Not one word to anybody in the family about why Steve Smith, he was shot in the back of his head. And as the only eyewitness says, time they kicked in the door, it was sudden. It wasn't time to comply with any verbal commands or anything. He was shot in the back of his skull, at the base of his skull. And I would tell you, Steve Smith, Mike Adams, Mr. President, any of you all, any of you all, if that happened and we were the suspects we were the shooters That's right and there was a bullet to the back of the head what else needs to be said murder it's murder murder bullet to the back of the head murder what else needs to be said a bullet to the back of the head what else needs to be said baton rouge West Baton Rouge, Parish Sheriff's Department. We are demanding answers and accountability. Before we have the family and the other great lawyers who are representing the family address you, we want full transparency, Mr. President, full transparency. What do we mean when we say full transparency? We want to know who was this police officer? Amen. Yes. who killed Joseph Richardson. His mother has a right to know. His family has a right to know. The community have a right to know. The nation has a right to know. We want to know about his, absolutely. We need to know it and we need to know it now. We want equal justice now. Because as Dr. King said, justice delayed, is justice denied. And so, Attorney Steve Smith, who I, I know is representing Jesse, who was in that room, we expect them to give all of the transparency. We want to know who the officer was. We want to know what is the officer background is. We want to know, Attorney O'Neill, does he have a pattern in practice? of using excessive force yes. against minorities right. and specifically African Americans. Well. Attorney Mike Adams, we want to know, has he ever killed anybody before? No. Yes. We want to know if this police officer has ever killed another black man. Yes. So we want to know if this police officer has ever shot anybody in that hotel That's before, right. well, we want to know, is this in any way personal? We want to know if this young lady and Joseph was targeted. We want to know. We want full transparency. We want, more importantly, the truth. And thank God, and thank God, we have an eyewitness that can defeat the narrative that they're going to present. 
because they're going to present a narrative, Mr. President, Attorney Moore, they're going to present a narrative where they're going to call Joseph Richardson everything but a child of God. Yeah.